adventurous. This is my story. Oh, oh, can you can you tell me what kind of story I'm gonna tell? Hmm. Are you sure? Yes, it's about creation. So, on the first day, when God looked at our world, he saw the world is very, very dark. Yes, but he doesn't want that, isn't it? He's a God with light, isn't it? So, on the first day, God said, let there be light. <gasps> and this was our first day. Can you see it? It's our first day. Yes, it's true. God created the light for us to see. It's true. So the first day was gone. On the second day, do you know what God created? Let's see if you remember. That's it. Well done. God created the water. And the clouds, the clouds to be on the sky and the water to be on the earth, isn't it? So we can play with water, isn't it? I love playing with water. My daughter too, my son too, my husband too. And you know what? Can you see this? Yes, it's a cotton wool, balls. If you put inside the water and you do this, what you can see? <gasps> Dropping. It's like a cloud when it's raining, isn't it? Yeah. And you can play over and over again. And God was so happy with. Oh, he was so pleased that we he created the water and the, all the rain and all the things that we can play with it, we can do with it, isn't it? Look. Oh, <laughs> It's getting different shapes, isn't it? Yeah. It's true. God created the water for us to play, to wash, and to... All right. So on the third day, what do you think God creates? Oh, are you sure? Let's go and see. Oh, yes, you're right. God created all the vegetables and all the fruits look at that fruits wow and cauliflowers and vegetables look mm -mm. i love watermelon and bananas too yes it's true i love all of kind of vegetables and fruits yeah and god created this for us to be strong and very healthy and I'm going to show you my trees. Look, I love those trees. Look at that tree. So tall. God created this lovely trees for us to, to... Oh, my days. Look at that. It's beautiful. God is so amazing. While God was creating all the things, on the fourth day, he thought, mm, I think the best thing to do now is to do some oh stars some oh, yeah a moon and a sun and that is on the fourth day and god was so pleased with all the stars that he created and all look at that so different stars big and and small and the moon and so the moon and the stars they are in the sky for us to see at night time and on the daytime God created the sun yes it's amazing isn't it and today if you look at oh look at that the sky is so blue can you see that wow I'm gonna try to show you the sun. Look. Oh, he's there. Can you see the sun? Oh my God, it's shining so much. Thank you, Lord, for the sun, the moon, and the stars. But you know what? God was not just 
satisfied. He said, why I'm creating all the things if I don't have animals? So God had an idea. On the fifth day, God created all the fishes for the water and all the birds for the sky. Let's go and see if you can spot some something in here. Let's see. Wow. Yeah. Can you spot the starfish? Oh, yeah. It's there. Let's go and see what is under the starfish. Oh, it's a dolphin. Look at that. Dolphin so happy, splashing and jumping over the water. Yeah. Let's go and see if it, we can spot the crab. Can you spot the crab? Where is the crab? Oh, yeah. There it is. Let's see what is under the... Let's see. Let's see what is under the crab. Oh, it's a goldfish. Yes, it is. They are so beautiful. Look at that orange, goldish color. Yes, it is. And let me see if you can spot a octopus. Yeah? Can you see an octopus? What? What? Uh, already passed? Are you sure? Oh, oh, yes, you, you're right. It's here. The octopus. Let's go. What is it under the octopus? Let's see. Oh, look at that. It's a turtle. Turtle loves going in the water too, isn't it? Loves going and going. Wow. Yes, it's true. And God was really, really, really happy with all the fishes and all the... Let's see what I have here. All the birds. Quack, quack, quack. Quack, quack, quack. Hello, my name is Green. <laughs> and you can hear all the, the birds is singing. And flying. It's true. So God was really, really, really happy. But something else was missing. So on a sixth day, God created... Can you see? Oh, are you ready? Can you tell me some of animals that God created on a sixth day? That's right. Perfect. Let's go and see. Wow, look at that. All the animals that can walk in on the earth, isn't it? So let's see what we have here. Oh, hello, little lamb. And we have a piggy. We have a squirrel. Can you see my scroll? Hello. Oh, we have a dog. Woof, woof. Oh, hedgehogs. Look, oh, this is a big lamb. <laughs> and God was so happy seeing all the animals appearing like, oh, look, a donkey. E -aw, e -aw, e -aw. Oh, look at them, a cow. What is the sound of the cow? What the cow that sounds? Oh, well done. Well done. Oh. <laughs> it's a monkey. Oh, a panda bear. Oh, and a lion. Wow, look. Oh, God is so great. Look at him. He's creating, look at the giraffe and the elephant, a leopard, a tiger. Wow. God was really, really happy now with all this creation. And he make you and me to play with all these animals, yeah? And play with the fishes and see all the stars and moons and sun. Play with the water, isn't it? God is amazing. And now, the last day, God created, not for him, but for us. For us to rest and to remember that he is with us every day. Not for us just to go to church, 
because we are the church. If, if we didn't exist, the church was not happening. So you, your mom, your dad, your brothers, your sisters, your family are the church. So you can be at home. And you can do a lot of stuff that God, God loves it. You can see this. What is this? That's it. Well done. It's a Bible. And we can have different kind of Bibles. Look, this is for babies, for little ones. This is for like big boys and big girls. And this is in Portuguese. This one is in Portuguese. You can see it says Biblia Sagrada. Is the same thing for Holy Bible, okay? But it's in my language. Maybe you have a Bible at home that is in your language, not in English. So you see, so many different kinds we can do at home, and we, so many different Bibles we have at home. So I think God is so amazing. I don't think. I have sure that God is amazing. And He created this day for us to remember that God loves us. And he creates all the things for us to take care, to protect, and to play and enjoy. Hope you have a good time with my story. I think it's a little bit big, but I think you can enjoy it. Love you all. Bye.